I'm ready. Gotcha. I'm ready. Okay. Scene one, Pulp Fiction. Vincent flips the two locks, opening the case. We can't see what's inside, but a small glow emits from the case. Vincent just stares at it, transfixed. Are we happy? No answer from the transfixed Vincent. Vincent! Vincent looks up at Jules. I said, are we happy? Closing the case. Statement? Paris? Par <laughs> Paris is out. Paris is... <laughs> Yo, we'll just do that as Liam Neeson. We'll just, I'll do that as we'll Liam Neeson. Through. Yeah, do it as Liam Neeson. Uh, uh, or I'll yeah. be. Look, what's your name? I got your name, Vincent, but what's yours? My name is Pitt, and you ain't taking your ass out of this shit. I, I just wanted to let you know how sorry we are about how fucked up things got between us and Mr. Wallace. When we entered this thing, we only had the best intentions. Brent talks, Jules takes out his gun and shoots Roger three times in the chest, blowing <laughs> him out of his chair. Vincent smiles to himself. Jules has got style. Brett has just shit his pants. He's not crying or whimpering, but he's so full of fear, it's as if his body is imploding. Oh, I'm sorry. Did I break your concentration? I didn't mean to. <laughs> oh, I didn't mean to do that. Please continue. I believe you were saying something about best intentions. Brett can't say <laughs> What's the matter? Oh, oh, you were through? Anyway, well, let me retort. Would you describe for me what Marcellus Wallace looks like? Brett still can't speak. Jules snaps, savagely tipping the card table over, removing the only barrier between himself and Brett. Brett now sits in a lone chair before Jules like a political prisoner in front of an interrogator. What country are you from? What? What ain't no damn country I know. Do they speak English in what? What? English, motherfucker. Can you speak it? Yes. Then you understand what I'm saying. Yes. Now describe to now describe what Marcellus Wallace looks like. What? Say <laughs> one again. Say one again. Come on, I dare you. I double dare you, motherfucker. Say what one goddamn more time. Now describe to me what Marcellus Wallace looks like. Happy. He, well, he, he, he's black. Go on. And he, he, he's bald. Now, does he look like a bitch? What? Jules' eyes go to Vincent. Vincent smirks. Jules rolls his eyes and shoot Brett in the shoulder. Brett screams, breaking into a shaking, trembling spasm in the chair. Does he look like a bitch? No! Then why did you try and fuck him? Why'd you try and fuck him like a bitch? Yes, you did. Yes, you uh -huh. did. All right, cool. Thank you, guys. I wish we had an audience so you guys could get a, a nice little, like, clap after that. So people watching, though. It's like six, well, it's 16 people are watching. So, I hope they're enjoying. We got, they, they we got a couple up, more scenes. They thumbing up and shit and, the, and all that good stuff. Once, so, once, once this really like gets gets big, you can um in, uh, invite a whole bunch of people to the Zoom. You know what I'm saying? That's can I take a quick like two second break? I just had to get a glass of water. Yeah, go go ahead. This is honestly yeah. this is good practice because I was trying to set up an OnlyFans account and uh, I mean this is like a good Shut up. what? No, I'm just saying like <laughs> I got juicy buns, bro, and a little bit of baby oil. <laughs> I'm a millionaire. Work that shit, bitch. <laughs> do you guys want to try? Do you guys want to go to um? You can do you can do Godfrey, right, Mo? Yeah. Do we want to try um Paris and Mo? Do you guys want to do the Gilbert Godfrey stepbrother scene? Yeah, we could do that. We could do that. Right. Let me let me go. Let me find it real quick. All right.
Let me know we're gonna you're do, ready, man. We're, we're, gonna gonna do we're gonna do Step Brothers with Mo and Paris, and then we're gonna go right to you with uh, Christopher Walken and Harry Met Sally. All right. So, oh shit, what the fuck? Hold up. Cool. I got. It. I just got. I'm trying to find it on my phone. This is unprofessional. Because it was. <laughs> You skipped over one, you know what I'm saying? Like the way you got it set up. Okay, I got it. I got it. Yeah. Ready? So yeah, I'm got the, it. yeah. All right. So you want me to do Pharaoh and you do Riley? Yeah, I'm doing, good, no, yeah. I'm doing Pharaoh. I'm doing Pharaoh. Okay. Okay. Go so ahead. for everyone watching right now, before we start, I don't know how many of you guys have seen Step Brothers. So this is a, a classic scene from Step Brothers. We have Paris playing Gilbert Godfrey as Will Ferrell's character. And then we have Mo Green playing Gilbert Gottfried as John C. Riley's character. So we have two Gilbert Gottfried clones. And uh, when you guys are ready, Paris, take us off. I can't believe I've been living here for two weeks and I'm walking around this place thinking, I got a huge douche for a stepbrother. Secretly, you're not a douche. Let's play a game, all right? On the count of three, Name your favorite dinosaur. Don't even think about it, just name it. Ready? One, two, three. Velociraptor. Oh, favorite non-pornographic magazine to masturbate to. One, two, three. Good housekeeping. Good housekeeping. Another one. If you are a chick, Who's the number one guy you sleep with? One, two, three. John, John Stamos. Stamos. <laughs> what? Did we just become best friends? Yeah, we did. Do you want to go do karate in the garage? Yep. Well, let's go, you motherfucker. <laughs> All right, guys, that was brilliant. <laughs> um, that good, was awesome. Pretty good. I liked it. Well, we'd like to try out next for you guys watching. Uh, this is a, a old classic rom com of sorts called How Harry Met Sally. Uh, quick scene description. So, in this scene in the film, <laughs> you've got Harry and Sally having a conversation in a diner. And basically, Sally's trying to talk to Harry and be like, hey, women fake their orgasms. It happens all the time. And Harry's character is like, no women's ever faked the orgasm with me. Like, what are you talking about? So it's kind of, you know, this is a common conversation we have. But this movie was made back when people didn't really talk about this kind of stuff, I think. So we're going to do this scene. But instead of Sally, we have Dennis gracing us with this Christopher Walken. And we have Paris as Harry gracing us with his Tracy Morgan. So uh, when you guys are ready, I'll do any stage directions here. No and uh, you guys ready to go? Yeah, ready. Perfect. So Harry and Sally are at a diner. So what do you do with these women? You just get, out of, get up out of bed and leave? Well, sure. Well, explain to me how you do it. What do you say? You say you have an early morning, uh, early haircut, or squash the game. You don't even play squash. They don't know that. They just met me. That's disgusting. I know. I feel terrible. You know, I'm so glad I never got involved with you. I just would have ended up being some woman you had to get up out of bed bed and leave at three o'clock in the morning and clean your ad irons and I know you don't even have a fireplace not that I would know this well why are you getting so upset you know this is not even about you yes it is you <laughs> are a human affront to all women and I am a woman Hey, I don't feel great about this. I don't hear anyone complaining. Of course you don't. You're out of the door too fast. Yeah, I think they have an okay time. How do you know? What do you mean, how do I know? Because I know, because I give it this thing. Because they... Yes, because they... And how do you know they really... 
what are you saying? They fake orgasms? It's possible. Get out of here. Why? Most women at one time or another have faked it. Well, they ain't never faked it with this ballpark fight. How do you know? Because I know I was there. Oh, right. That's right. I forgot. You're a man. What's that supposed to mean? Nothing. It's just that all men are sure it never happened to them and that most women have faked it one time or another. So you do the math. Well, you don't think that I could tell the difference? No. You know what? Get out of here. I'm a pro. Uh oh. Uh oh. Ooh. Are you okay? Oh. Don't start. <laughs> oh, God. Shit. Oh. Oh. Shit. oh, damn it. Damn it, Stop baby. It, Ooh. Diner. Stop it. Come on. You're making me blush. Oh, yes. Stop. Stop that is the it. best. Stop that net. We're in a di- Oh, yes. 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 Oh, God. Oh, God. Yes. 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 Damn get it. Me yes. Pregnant. Yes! Oh, that's the best. Oh. Sally finishes, looks at Harry and smiles. Harry looks back, looking a little uneasy. Someone at another table says, Uh, I'll have what she's having. All right, cool. So that was amazing. Uh, If you've never heard Christopher Walken have a female orgasm before, you can cross that off your bucket list. Yeah, that can't say great. that no more. Um, oh, oh, oh. Yes, oh, yes, oh. yes. Oh. Give yeah, it to oh. me, baby. Ow, oh, ow. Oh. I feel like a offspring. So I'm just writing down the to send in the chat the um, next. So we're doing a scene from Avengers next. Uh, yes. one of my, I'm a huge yeah. fucking nerd. I love superhero stuff. I had to throw in Avengers some somewhere in here. So what we have here for Avengers is we have, um, I'm going to just say the voices and you guys will see who's doing them. So we have Chris Tucker as Nick Fury. So you're going to picture if Samuel Jackson was in cast and Chris Tucker was instead. We have Jackie Chan as Thor. We have Seinfeld as Tony Stark. We have Peter Griffin as Bruce Banner. And then we have Barack Obama as Captain America, Steve Rogers. <clears throat> so, uh, for our actors, um, let's see. Are you guys ready to start? Yeah, yeah. we can do it. Let's do it. So, right. I'm, I'm doing Barack, right? Yes, please. Okay, yeah. right. just making sure. All right. So, uh, I'd like to are there know. stage directions for this? Yes, question? It's okay. No, I was just, I was reading the line, but. <laughs> okay. Sorry. Hold on. My laptop's being a little s- slow right now. I just want to make sure that if there's stage directions that I can cover them. Yeah, you got to defragment your shit, man. Just give me an action. All right. All right. My shit is being. All right. Fuck the count. Wait, no, I think I can do this. Yo, Paris is a sniper on the bridge. Watch out, man. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna just, I'm gonna freeze. My face is gonna freeze. You guys can still hear me, right? Yeah. Yeah. All right. Then I'm just gonna open this up on my phone and do it on my phone. My face doesn't have to move. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. So we are starting with. All right. Uh, action. I'd like to know why Shield is using the Tesseract to build weapons of mass destruction. It's his fault, man. Nick Fury points at Thor. Me? Last year, Earth had a visitor from another planet who had a grudge match in, in, in a level town somewhere, man. We learned we're not the only ones. We hopelessly outnumbered, man. Hopelessly. Our gun. My people want nothing but peace for your planet. Yeah, but you're not the only people in the archery. And you're not the only threat. The world's good enough with bad people, man. They can't be matched. They can't be controlled. Like, uh, you, uh, control the kill. 
You're walking with the Tesseract is what drew Loki to it. His allies. It is a signal that realm, the, <laughs> it is a signal to all realms that the earth is ready for a higher form of power, war. A hey, uh, higher form? You forced our hand, man. We had to come up with something. Nuclear deterrent, because that always calms everything to write down. Remind me again who made your fortune stock. I thought humans were more evolved than this. Excuse me, when do we come to your planet and blow shit up? You speak of control, yet you court chaos. This is his MO, isn't it? I mean, what are we, a team? No, no, no. We're a chemical mixture that makes chaos. We're, we're a time bomb. You need to step the hell away, man. Tony Stark puts his arm around Captain America. Why shouldn't this guy let off a little steam? Tony Stark is pushed off by Captain America. Uh, you know damn well. Uh, back off. Tony Stark faces Captain America face to face. Oh, I'm starting to want you to make me. The big man in the suit of armor. Take that off. What are you? Genius, billionaire, playboy, philanthropist. Listen, I uh, I know guys with uh, none of that. We're for uh, 10 of you. Yeah, I've seen the footage. The only thing you're ready to fight for is uh, yourself. You're not the guy to make the sacrifice play, to lay down on a wire and let the other guy crawl over. I think I would just cut the wire. Always a way out. You know, you may not be a threat, but uh, you better stop pretending to be a hero. A hero like you? You're a lab rat, Rogers. Everything special about you came out of a bottle. Hey, listen, motherfucker. Put that suit on and let's go off the rounds. Thor laughs at them. You people are so petty and tiny. <laughs> All right. Awesome. You, you, you Good job, fucking, guys. Your I'm fucking Jackie you. Chan is fucking nuts, man. That shit is fucking Dude. Oh, I work a very longer time. Thank you. Oh, that was, that was, oh, that was now, Paris. That was you doing that shit? Yes, I do. A, I do a Jackie Chan and I do a Bruce Lee. Ja I thought for some reason I thought Jack said Jack Savage. Do you have a Jackie Chan or no? I mean, I could just do a stereotypical Asian guy. For some reason, I thought I thought that was Jack the whole time. He's a so I, racist. When I'm reading my lines, I'm not I'm not looking at who's who's saying what. For some nah, reason, I was doing Tucker and Jackie. Oh, that shit fucked me up. That's some good shit. Damn, that's not like two <laughs> different niggas. I had it, I just had it, I had it in the background, and I don't know if anyone, like, if you guys are watching this right now, feel free to, like, you can even put this in another tab, you can, like, close your eyes, like, I almost feel like, because it's fun to watch you guys act it out, but it almost enhances, because I had the app in my background, so I, it literally just sounded like two separate people speaking yeah. when I didn't have the visual. Yeah, I could have so, sworn Jack was reading that part, that shit is crazy. It's great. Um, is there anything you guys, anything else, any other comments you guys want to add? By the way, Paris, yeah. I saw you, you uploaded Bruce Lee today, right? Is that super new? The other or, day. The, the other day. day. Yeah. I saw it and I, I just, the water shit was, I almost, I almost put Bruce Lee in here just because I was. 99% of your body is made of water. So empty your mind. Be formless, shapeless, water, like water. I always want to do it right after, but like, I can't. So I'm just like, I'm going to let him do it. And I'm going to just wish that I could. Like, that's. <laughs> All right, so here's what we're gonna do. Up next, where's our final scene for you guys? Uh, if you guys are enjoying this, uh, this is something we wanna do some more. We have one more scene left. Um, also, if people is... wanna comment with suggestions too, might not be a bad yeah, idea. Yeah, we'll totally, we'll totally get there. Um, I definitely, I mean, if you guys wanna do it now, um, if you guys would like to see us, um, if there's any scenes that you guys would like to see us do, like, oh, I love this scene or movie, put it in a movie, put it in a scene. We'd love to, to do a scene from that movie or that scene itself. Um, and it doesn't have to be a live action movie. It can be animated. You can say, fuck it, do a scene from Avatar The Last Airbender. We'll get Iroh up in here. Dragon Ball Z, we'll get Goku up in here. Do Dora the Explorer. Hey, like, we'll do General fucking Dave Iroh. Chappelle as Dora. There's so many different I think General Iroh is a very good idea. Well, Prince Zuko. I think that we can do General Iroh. <laughs> Dude, I'm so excited for the future of this. Oh, um, oh yeah. 
Get cut, so, did I get cut off or something? I don't know what I did. No, you're, you're here. You do. I like minimize my thing and I can't get it back. A bit. There we go. So um, for the right. interview, we have uh, Jack Savage will be playing Morgan Freeman. Morgan Freeman will be interviewing Mike Tyson, who is played by Mo Green. <laughs> and then we have Paris, who will be Dave Chappelle who is in this film. So I'll give you guys two of the roles. So in this film, Morgan Freeman, James Franco is interviewing Eminem while Seth Rogen's in the background controlling the TV, the TV, the scene going on. So in this instead, it's going to be Morgan Freeman interviewing um, Mike Tyson while Dave Chappelle is kind of in the back watching everything go on. So this is our last scene. Hope you guys enjoy it. And then we'll talk to you guys for a bit if you guys want to talk. I, I hope you guys got stuff you guys want to say, but... Um, Let me draw some. Say oh, when you guys are ready. Action. Well, good e evening, everyone. I'm Dave Skyline. Tonight we are joined by 13-time Grammy winner, Oscar-winning songwriter, Detroit's own Eminem. He will speak with us about his new album, which has been mired in controversy concerning lyrics that some view as demeaning <laughs> to the elderly. Tonight on Skylock Tonight. And action, baby. It's hell to be shady. Yesterday, I yelled a degrading insult at an elderly lady. Then I asked her how it felt to be a <laughs> F-word of senior citizen. Suck a wiener. Sit in spin. And why you drive so slow for? Don't you know when you get where you're going faster since you'll probably die tomorrow? You old whore. Die, old bitch, die, before I murder you. What do you mean by this, Em? Well, well, well first of all, I, I feel like uh, when I rap, it's like, it's like people twist my words. OK, but can you see how an old person might say, I think what this guy is telling me, this Eminem, is that I should go kill myself. And you know, I don't like that. I mean, I mean, I, I don't necessarily rap about the things I hate. It's more, it's more about the things that I fear. All right, I und I understand you. <clears throat> you know, you know, it's it's like it's like if I say something about a woman or whatever, I I think I think a lot of that is more or less me just dealing with issues. You know, it's like old issues, like with my mom or whatever. Exactly, with your mother. Yeah, or, or and you know, like when when I say things about about gay people or people that think that my my lyrics are homophobic, you know, it's it's, it's because I'm gay. And, and and when I rap about violence or you know, sound like I'm promoting violence, I think uh, you know, it's more or less because, you know, it's it's, it's kind of like a it's it, it's kind of a, about myself, about me just you know just confronting it. Excuse me, what did he just say? What did he just say? Did he say he was gay? We're pretty sure on the booth, we just heard him say he was gay, son. Well, let's just back up for a moment. You just said that you were gay, uh, and I'm curious. What did you mean by that exactly? Well, it, it, it means I'm gay. I'm just a little confused here, because gay can mean a lot of things. It means I'm a homosexual. Meaning? I like men. Holy shit! Holy shit! Eminem's gay on our show, nigga! Oh! Eminem's gay! Gay Twitter! Gay Twitter's blowing up, son! Day! Keep him talking, son! This is the greatest moment in gay history! Listen, I'm more shocked that people haven't figured it out yet. I mean, it's, it's kind of like I've been playing like a gay peekaboo. Uh, what do you mean when you rapped? I said nice rectum. I had a vasectomy after. So you can't get pregnant if I buy a sexually wreck you. I mean, I've, I've been pretty much leaving a, like a breadcrumb trail of gayness the whole time. I fuck your mother too. I guess I see that now, you gay motherfucker you. Hey, watch it, day. I'll stick my it's pigeons crazy. on you. I'll stick my pigeons on you. Hey, I'll stick, my, I'll stick my wrinkly old freckled penis so far up your rapping ass that you won't know what's what anymore. 
I'm gonna fuck Y'all these... niggas is gay. Oh shit. Morgan said, gonna... Freeman's gay too. Gay niggas. Gay niggas everywhere. Ow. I was gay before it was cool to be gay. I want to eat and... your children. <laughs> all praise be to all praise be due to, due to Allah. <laughs> and sin. <laughs> that was beautiful, guys. Yeah. I love the love the little little. <laughs> you guys just took it and ran with it. Namaste. <laughs> so, um, yeah, I don't know if there's anything you guys want to want to say. Anything you guys want to comment on? Well, I just want to reiterate that I'm not racist, um, and just to make that clear. Uh, all right, get out. <laughs> you were, you were, you were doing virtual blackface earlier. I don't know if that right, listen, where that falls on the spectrum. Di- it's not. It's not weird if it's digital. I told you, can... you that. I told you that in a in a sta- in in confidence, confidence and safety. <laughs> are you are you no longer confident? Are you insecure now? Like no, I'm incredibly I'm incredibly secure. I, I, <laughs> I mean, I feel like a black guy, so I'm like real confident right now. Like, well, I mean, really. You're black, me. You're just as black as Bill Clinton, so he looks just like Clay Thompson. <laughs> I look like Clay Thompson. Yeah, you do. Y'all the same complexion. Are we same hairstyle? <laughs> I think all are you saying all white people look alike? That's a little rid- <laughs> No, that was that was dope, guys. That was hilarious. Yeah, no, it was it was, it was like you got a great you have a great idea on your hands, Tom. I think it'll get better. Yeah, like once we once we get the scripts in time. You know, mm-hmm. like within, because we kind of did this shit within an hour. We yeah, yeah we kind of nailed it. Yeah. Once we like, and then you know, we kind of just brainstorming like our strongest impersonations, and it's good that we did that because I feel like the last scene came out a lot better because we all did our you know our strengths, but we just need to uh, keep doing that moving forward in the future. We just rehearse for like an hour or so, just kind of get it down. But like have have the scripts even beforehand, just so we're like familiar with the material, and then you know we can you know pick our characters. You know, I, I think you don't mind us picking our voices or whatever. And, and then, I don't know, scenes. I was just thinking about this, too. Like, it might make sense to do maybe scenes with, um, like, maybe, like, longer scenes, but where we all can do it. You know what mm-hmm. I mean? Like, at least everyone could do at least one character where we can go back and forth. Like, I kind of like the Avengers one because we all got our moments in it. Yeah, yeah, yeah more, yeah, more yeah. I agree. That was a really fun one. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and then, um, one thing, I don't know why, I just keep thinking of Jurassic Park. Like, I just love that movie, and I just keep thinking of all the scenes, and we could we could digitally do our background instead of dinosaurs in the back. Yeah, yeah, and stuff yeah. like we could like we totally play with it and i don't know maybe we like toy with the idea of maybe doing a uh, picking a movie and just doing scenes from one specific movie and just yeah i <laughs> definitely want to do a whole reading at some point find a yeah. movie or episode show like i think a breaking bad i got really good episode of breaking oh, bad so many. Yeah, 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 yeah. it's fucking or even just movies. like break down like three scenes from like one really epic movie where like it's the same four characters we just keep switching things up and making it crazy like, I don't know, I just keep thinking of Jurassic Park where, like, they're all eating and they're arguing about dinosaurs and, like, they're freak- some are freaking out. I don't know, I just think something like that would be kind of fun. I want to I want to do a Vince Vaughn one. I think that would be fun. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I, 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 I want to throw a Vince Vaughn in it. I mean, I, I want to do it. I want to motorboat something. I want to read some lines. I want to get out there. I want to really, you know, get into action. I wanna, I'm gonna what are it. some... Could you wow, guys dude. throw out... Wow. Voices? I, love I, I got a Vince Vaughn, too. Yep. Could you guys throw out some voices you'd like to do and also scenes you'd like to do. So if I have a, like a list, I can be like, oh my God, this voice and this voice is these characters and this movie is like perfect. So if there's anything that comes to mind right now. Owen Wilson, dude. Mad cool, man. Wow. Oh, I forgot. I, I, got a, I got a Trump. Crashers, bro. Oh, you Listen. guys do Owen Wilson? Okay, yeah. Wow. yeah. Listen, this is I, one of the greatest I, I, ideas that Tom Roach had. It is splendid. It is wonderful. We're dealing with coronavirus, but once we it's get this- It's white face. I don't approve. It's starting to heal every single person in America. I this is reverse this. racism, folks. Reverse Yo, racism. What about bad boys, too? Remember um, when Will Smith had the guns? He said, stop all the goddamn movement. Yo, I want to do that as Bernie Mac. <laughs> do bad boys, too. There's two scenes I want to do from bad boys. We can do that scene, and I want to do the scene where they open up the door when the dude comes for the date with the daughter and yeah. Will Smith. And I think those are two good scenes that... Try to do my, my Norm MacDonald. Hey, oh, you uh, got a Norm McDonald? I uh, I uh, I was talking to this guy, and uh, I eventually sucked his cock. <laughs> <laughs> wow! Wait for it. Wait for. Wow! I want to. I want to. I mean, I know it's hard to find a character, but I love doing the Michael Moore. I just don't know why. Like the sadder the story, the better. And then they all died together in that coal mine. Put Michael Moore. Michael Valentin said Pineapple Express when they're in the woods. So I'm gonna add that to the list. Mm-hmm. 
I mean, I can kind of do. I'm working on the bird right now. <laughs> fucking Seth Rogen laugh. <laughs> Bill Burr. This fucking guy is coming over here. He's saying all these crazy things. I don't know what's wrong with these broads. Jack Nicholson oh, here Burr, trying to tell you Bill that Burr. you're all being a little crazy yeah, yeah. here, man. Oh, my God. You guys are brutal. I mean, you're killing it right now. Oh, my. It's amazing. The Jay uh, Baron show. Oh, we should do this as the end. Is- he this said, is the this is, end. This is crazier than a motherfucker, man. I got all these people coming around and trying to shoot me these couple doo 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 Mo, you, I don't know. Who, I don't know who sing, sings here, but like I would be down to do like a, a song. Is like I do like a Frank Sinatra. I mean, I do rap. I do different rappers and stuff like that. Oh my god, yeah! If you have musicians, yeah, fucking please. What? Yeah, I do. I'll do a Frank. I'll do a Frank Sinatra. I can do a Yellow Wolf. I don't know, he's not super not, I'm uh I can do Yellow Wolf too. <laughs> no. Can sing as Christopher Walken, which is not really singing. Frank Sinatra. It's like Paul Face. She's got to love nobody. I wanna do it. Like they do you know, in Texas are there, plays. I, I know you can sing in general, Mo. Are there any characters that you can keep the impression while singing? Oh, that's good. It depends. Like if, if you tell me the song, I'll try it. I'll try I've never done that. But if you tell mm-hmm. me like which song you want me, I, I could try to work it out, try to figure something out. Okay, that's, that's difficult. That's like an impersonation on top of singing. That's some yeah. hard shit, but I could try. You know, I could learn it. Oh, I sing love my position <laughs> in my land. <laughs> I sing like a, as Stevie Wonder. I've come not too far for you and I to say. Krusty, <laughs> I think I, this is just me, but I feel like. <laughs> This is more like white singers, but I just think like Tom Petty just sounds like a better vocalist than Bob Dylan. He's like, she was an American girl. You know, like, it's not she that far off. Like, in the end of town, had a good looking mama, but she never yeah. was around. You know what yeah, I mean? Like, I, she, like, he's not I, like a greatest I, singer. I Yo, definitely like, hear that like, Bob Dylan. Hell yeah. like, she was an American girl. You your cornbread. Yeah, I mean, you're my you cornbread, man. Cornbread. You can't have my cornbread. You might as well go over there and get your own parts from cornbread. It's my cornbread. You know what impersonation I, I never hear people do? Like Martin. Martin doesn't have a distinct oh, voice. Oh, you Martin. can't do Martin Lawrence. Oh, you got to do Martin. It's Big Even Martin's when, house. When he talks, but that's like Martin turned up, like the no, regular I, Martin voice. If you want to do Martin Lawrence, you got to, you know, you got to be with this shit, Mike. If you okay, go to okay. Mar, you gotta be with this shit. I'm not with it. <laughs> I can't get Sam Jackson. Know, I, right. I can't. You know what's funny? I got like a lot of local comedians, so. but people don't. You know do who local they are. comedian impressions? I got a lot of them. Though. I I got a. Uh, uh, what do you call? Uh, <laughs> who who are who are some that you think I might know? Like any local uh, comedian? You know, you like, know you know Jackson. I don't know if I know Jackson. You know you know Brian Barkinay. Everybody knows him. Yeah, 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 I dude. do know Brian. Yeah, yeah. I, I love this girl Brian's the other day, man. and it's like I got really skinny. So like when I fucked, I lasted like a really long time, and I stabbed her stomach. Abortion Falcon. <laughs> I, have an, I have an okay Cliff Moolah. I can do his laugh. Come here. Oh, can I <laughs> do it again. Do it. <laughs> It's dead on. Bro, it's the most contagious. Like, I hear the laugh. Like, <laughs> I got Richie. So I got funny. Richie. So I got, I think me and Paris, we both got gay, Richie. Dude, that's gay. You Richie gay Hector. as hell, Mo. Hey, yo, like, I don't even know why niggas be trying to hate on me. I'm just trying to blow up in a game. Like, these motherfuckers not even on my level. Like, I was on tour with all kinds of niggas like four years ago. You got to boss up. Like, what the fuck? Oh, you talking about Wait, Richie? someone do Artie niggas Rob. Someone's got to have an Artie Rob. Niggas is trying to get their bread and shit. I I do all these nigga. I do. Uh, I'm gonna fucking do all these. It's fucking Artie <laughs> Rob, nigga. Fucking Artie Rob. Artie. I'm dope, nigga. I'm dope. Listen, I'm a bad motherfucker. I'm on. So your breath stink. I'm a listen, nigga. Your breath stinks, nigga. I fucking tell <laughs> you. I fucking do it like it is. I have you fucked up like Granny on the fucking Walker going down the fucking street. <laughs> I y'all know, fucking, um, y'all, know uh, y'all know J T Moore, James Moore. Mm-hmm. He said, hey, listen, James Moore, JT Moore from Hartford, Carolina. <laughs> I'm just out here trying to, trying to do my comedy, whatever. No, I was born in Hartford, but I grew up in Bridgeport. But really, I was born in Bloomfield, and I grew up in Sonia. But I, I like to say all the, all the tough cities, 
You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm just out here trying to get this bag, you know, the Bijou Theater, just dropped my special and everything. Like, niggas ain't fucking with me. You know what I'm saying? I'm just out here getting this paper. Oh, Jesus. Is that That's good. I do. I do. I do. Is that Brian I Regan? Do, uh, I do. Holy shit. Mar- uh, Marshall Brandy. I do Marshall Brandy. <laughs> you no, know, motherfucking. The Amish, nigga. The Amish is fucked up, man. And I'll tell you right now, they're from lying motherfuckers. They lying motherfuckers. I'll tell you right now that the Amish is the most lying group of people. <laughs> you know, you know, I'm um, comedian Jackson. I got him too. He, he said, listen, man, like, I've been doing comedy for about 15 years. And the thing is, I've surpassed everybody's level. So nobody can compete with my comedy styling on stage. Because that's what I do. My name is Jackson. When I talk on stage, I make sure my tongue is extra big so you can really hear my lips. But in real life, I don't talk non stop. No, I forgot. That's ridiculous. I, when I I'm Jim Gaffigan, and I just have to say that's ridiculous. Uh, <laughs> Jim Gaffigan. I can don't I ask believe you, guys, you people are talking like this. Can I ask you guys a, a question? Yeah, a question away. What? Yeah, so I just want to. I'm curious you. in general. Look, look. Go ahead, I'm going to humor you. I'm going to answer you like fucking Bill Burr. Go ahead. Go all ahead. right, all right, Bill Burr. So this is a question. Bill Burr, uh, and if you guys want to answer it's this, in, I'm going to say this. Answer this. Just You guys are only allowed to answer this question as an impression. So okay. how did you, uh, and this is going to be a question you've been asked a million times, probably for you guys, but how did you get into impressions? Are you fucking kidding me? Really? Going to go over there with that stupid shit? How the fuck did you learn? I, I just did it, okay? I fucking, you know, I watched yeah. TV and I fucking copied the voice. Boom, I did it. You can do it too. Well, the, fuck. the, the way that I, I, I started doing my impressions is before I got caught jerking off in front of people, I was like, I saw this like really specific thing and it just made me want to become somebody else that I actually want. That's, that's my Louis C.K. <laughs> I started doing impressions as a young man. I was born with the inability to sing. So in the shower, I talked to myself and my friends in my head. <laughs> Those voices in my head sounded exactly how I sound because the acoustics in normal bathrooms are perfect. I was able to hone in my skills on the shitter in the shower, sometimes one right after the other. I did my best. And at the end of the day, I feel like I've won an Academy Award in my heart. <laughs> Boy. Well, uh, <laughs> I started doing impressions right after I won the presidency. <laughs> God love it. Me and Bill went it. back and forth. <laughs> then he got caught up with Epstein. <laughs> and then- God bless Chubby Juice, baby. Come on, I love it. <laughs> Big Bubba, baby. Come on. Hey, man, this is awesome. Now, you know, the first time I, I, I started doing impressions when I was with David Robinson, I was a starting point guard, Avery Johnson, you know, and I had to start talking in different ways so they can understand exactly. Let me stop. That's my Avery Johnson. Let me tell your ass from right now. I'll tell you what the fuck I'm doing. You know what I'm saying? That's the first time I do a motherfucking it. impression, I watch the burning motherfucking Mac. You know what I'm saying? Great the motherfucking man. And I was watching the motherfucker, and I was trying to go, I was going to school, I say all his motherfucking jokes. That's what the fuck I did. I ain't scared of you motherfuckers. Do you guys want to say... I have a quick story. Do you guys, story. Want, to, do you Ooh, guys want to say any final words? Any final words, and we can close this off? Follow me on Instagram, Matt, Impression Prince. Holla at me. Yes. Um, if you guys... Um, when you guys are done with this, just please leave your... Leave your that's what we're going to do next time. I'm going to say it now so we don't forget. We can also put people's ats and shit in the description. Yeah, so yeah, yeah. that's something to keep in mind. All of our IGs and shit, yeah. yeah. I don't have many, but it's good. Okay. Yeah, are you guys... Any Anyone else want to comment there? The ats, share their stuff? Sure. Uh, my, my Instagram is jack underscore savage underscore comedy. Uh, TikTok is at Jackie Savage. Um... And I have a I have 199 Facebook followers, so fuck with me. It, it, it. You see, you see what he said. You see the motherfucking comments. He said, "Bunny Mac, the motherfucking goat." You know who fucking. <clears throat> I'm Dennis with the Z Gifford on Facebook. That's what I use. I don't tweet. 
He said, listen, man, I came all back from the grave. Muhammad Ali, the greatest fighter of all time. I say, I strike like lightning. I hit like thunder. And if I make you laugh, oh. you won't go under. Ooh, you better believe it. I That's wonderful. Bullshit. You guys are just like Karen. All right, you got, okay, you got Muhammad Ali. Okay, I'll tell you one time, I'll tell you two times. I'm bad, man. I'm fast and I'm bad. I'll come there, I'm fast, I'm pretty, and I'm telling you right now, I whoop. You know, you know, I, I, I'm, 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 I'm tired of people like saying that, that, that um, Muhammad Ali is the best fighter of all time because I, I, I feel like I'm, I'm, I'm 50 and old. I, you know, I, I, I be kind of well, a brother. I, 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 I want to cross. Yo, I, 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 I want to cross. Yo, the, you big bear, what do you want? I knock you clean out. You big you know, bear, what do you want? Well, like, like, what, what, whatever, Connor, we, we, could, we, 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 could, we could do this again for another 50 million. I mean, I mean light, yo, light, work, light work, they, they, they always try to hate on me, but you know, I, 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 I stay in the gym. I, I you know, wrestle with an alligator. I tussle with a whale. I'm handcuffed lightning, thrown thunder in jail, man. I'm bad. I'm bad. I'm knocking lights out. Which one is that? That's Muhammad, man. I'm fast. Come on. I'm, I'm fast. I'm fast. He's fast it. He's a, he's, he sings like he almost sings when he talks. He's like, oh, fast, ooh, man. I'm fast. I'm pretty. And nobody can stop me. Ain't nobody I'm beat on top me. of my game. Fast. Who has I'm pretty. I want to. I want to. You know what? I want to study George Foreman. I want to try to get his voice down. See, you know what's funny about my impressions? I don't. I don't practice impressions either. I know how to do it or I don't. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like. I hear it like that's one time. That's ridiculous. And if I hear it, I do it, but I'm, I'm lazy with trying to learn it. And I think that's what's going to take me to the next level. It's all about actually, hearing yourself. I, th I think yeah. like when you can hear yourself and like, I think the bathroom's good, but like any place you can hear yourself, like it drives people nuts. But man, like you can get like so close and get, just play with it just a little bit and you get it. Let me check this. See if I got this on every spirit. Listen, motherfucker. I don't care what none of you guys are saying. If you're going out in the street and you're looting, you need to shut the fuck up, my caps. No, black on black crime is a poor excuse. I don't know. It is I, I, I think if I practice it, I could get Ari. Ari Spears is one of like the only imp oh, impressionists. Oh, hey, hey, live with Regis and Kelly. <laughs> Mo, Mo Green, can I ask you a question, Nick? Can you do motherfucking Paul Mooney? That's the question I'm asking right now. Can you do Paul Mooney? Because I cannot. I cannot do Paul Mooney. I'm not. <laughs> I tried it. I tried to do it. No, this comedian you know I can do. I, I, I can't can do think of no dialogue. I can't think of no. But I, I used to do it. But I have to listen. listen I don't. Listen. I don't listen to Paul enough, so yeah, I, I, I can't I really had do it, it before. But, but I need oh, I can get words. like I can get the tone. But part Rich of the impersonation and Red Fox. Yeah, part of the impersonation. You you gotta have words to say. You can't just make sounds unless it's Chris Tucker. So bleh, 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 bleh. you guys want to? I'll go oh, around yeah, doing man. your best. You guys want to go around doing your best movie guy voice, and that was how we can maybe end it. Yeah, sure. In a, in a world, one man must fight to survive. They didn't know. Three children, four tortillas, one midget. This summer. I don't know. I couldn't think of anything else to go with that, but you want to do a movie guy voice and just go around? Yeah, 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 sure. Let me look at my list. On, on Zoom, five guys, many voices, coming to you soon. This has only been one episode. But more to come. I don't know. In a world Next. where there's two black guys, two white guys, and one guy who we can't tell what he is. <laughs> we all try to come together and have gay sex for racial harmony and do impressions. We call it Zoom. Coming to a theater near you where a group of men who are looking to get sex changes this summer after the COVID, it's bottomed out. <laughs> and I'm going to cap this off. I don't do impressions, but I can fucking try. Keanu does movie trailers now. <laughs> Keanu, no. No, no, right, no. no. Um, Dude. I had, a, I had a lot of fun doing this. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You guys definitely. together. Yep. I want to do this more. Um, so I guess we can just... We're just gonna, Say bye if you want to cut the cut the Facebook stream, but keep right, the Zoom. Open. I'm, I'm kind of I'm cutting the Facebook stream. Oh, right. Facebook stream is done. Uh, 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 uh.